guys, what's going on? It's Amy again with Bargain Mama, and sorry I got very quiet towards the end of my last video. The garage door was open, and I felt like somebody was like close to it or something, and so I had to end that video and um, close the garage door. So if you see anyone peeking up there, let me know. So, anyways, I just did a very small thrift store haul and a Dollar Tree haul, and now we are going to do a huge, huge clearance. Um, Dollar General haul and then if I have enough time I will do um, Hobby Lobby in here if not then I'll do a third video in the heat of this um, garage right now so let's get started because it is super hot here so I went so these are from two separate days one is from yesterday which was Monday and so on Monday they were still having 50% off of the clearance so I got an additional 50% off of everything and then today it did not have an additional so I'll let you know um, so Purple Dot was supposed to be a penny. Today is Tuesday, and so usually stuff pennies. It was supposed to penny today. It did not, I went to three different stores and my stores did not penny for Purple Dot. So I put quite a bit of stuff back because I didn't want to have, even at 90%, like I didn't need it or want it really that much. So I put a lot of stuff back. But so this is starting, so this is from Monday. So this is 50% off of the already, like 90% off or whatever. So. I picked this up, um, it is a dish drying mat, like in red, white, and blue. You see that it was $4 and it has the purple dot on it. Um, I believe this was 40 cents, I just want to make sure. Um, I'm sorry, I'll try to go fast, but I'm just not. Um, dish drying mat. Oh, yeah, so I paid 20 cents for this, super good deal. Oh yeah, because it was 90%, just 40 cents. Okay, so I paid 20 cents for that. Um, so this Betty Crocker blueberry mix, I paid $1.35 for. It is still in date and everything. They just, I get rid of stuff and I love me some blueberry muffins. So I plan on making those. So I don't know their normal price, but they had it on clearance for $2.70 and then it was an additional 50% off. So I paid $1.35 for 16.9 ounces of Betty Crocker blueberry mix. I got these. And then I did get a lot more of these bead things, um, but again, oh, I said it in my last haul, um, a lot of the bins and baskets and stuff that I hauled um, a couple days ago from Dollar General, and then a lot of the stuff that I got yesterday and today, I already gave to my daughter-in-law for my new grandson's room. I didn't get a chance to haul some stuff, but it does not matter. I do not want it in my house. I do not want the clutter. And so, yeah. A, all that stuff. So sometimes when you see me hauling stuff, you're like, oh, why do you have so much? Girl, it is not in this house, okay? It is not here. So I guess I forgot to give her this. I think this was, and it's for a boy. I don't, but I got this because it was a dollar, so 10 cents. So I think this was five cents. I'm just going to make sure, but I'm pretty sure it was only five cents. I don't even know that it's necessary for me to find it, but um, anyways, I think it was, oh, but see, then you get frustrated and you get like addicted to finding stuff. Anyways, um, yeah, so I think it was five cents because it's a dollar. So then it was 10 cents with 90% off and then that, yeah, so it was five cents. It's just this cute little moon with the beads. Um, I picked this up. Oh, this smells amazing. And so this is a scented candle, three ounces. I don't know what it's scented is. What does this say? Ocean Tide. It smells amazing. It's three ounces, normally $3. So I paid 15 cents for this because it was 90% off plus another 50 yeah so I paid 15 cents for this candle amazing um if you've watched my hauls I do pack my 18 year old's lunch when he goes to work or when he's here when I'm here I mean and he loves to take gum and so I just found this and so it's just the trident mega spearmint 10 pieces normally 68 cents and so I did pay this 67 so I guess it's normally 135 so I paid 67 cents for 10 pieces of gum so that's just for him to take to work I was super excited to find these you guys know I'm into coloring right now these are fine liners a five pack um, 0.4 millimeters by office hub so they say they were 270 so I paid a dollar 35 for those which I think is a great deal so I got those I am loving my coloring I'm like a child if you guys watch, I don't think I put it in a video, I don't know, but um, in one of my other ones, um, I hauled like my Mickey and Minnie like briefcase that's not colored on the outside and had all the coloring stuff in it. You guys, I walked through the airport, you should have seen people looking, they were like, I was a little embarrassed, I'm, I just noticed some of my um, markers were over there. Hmm. Um, 
I was a little embarrassed. I get very shy and very embarrassed. You wouldn't know it, but I do. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, so I picked these up and they are True Living Eraser Sheets, eight multi-purpose cleaning sheets. Um, so they are just like the dry eraser sheets. And so I think I paid a dollar for those because they're normally $2 and so I paid a dollar. I'm just looking. You guys, when I start panicking to look, I think it is, let me just make sure. Anyways, yeah, yeah, so, anyways, yeah, I think I paid a dollar, because it's two dollars and it was half off, so I paid a dollar for all those eraser sheets, which I think is a good deal. These blankets, so they had accidentally put these blankets out with, um, hold on a second, hold on, beads, 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 dish drying mat, beads, I'm telling you got a lot of beads, but they are not here. Um, beads, beads, spearmint, maybe I did get this at another store. I didn't think I went to more than one. But anyways, so they had accidentally, or whatever, put out purple dots, and they had two of these blankets that were purple dots. So they are two different ones. This is a kid's soft throw, 40 by 60 inches with cats, and it's the very thin one. So 90% off was a dollar. So I paid 50 cents for this one, which is amazing. So I got that for 50 cents. And this is the thicker blanket, and it's a kid's soft throw, 40 by 50, but it's like um, thicker. This one has unicorns, and so I paid 50 cents for that. Um, I might so we don't have any girls or anything, but my dogs love soft blankets, and so we do put blankets on the floor for them a lot, and then wash them until whatever, and then throw them away. So I might give this to my little princess, Belle. So for 50 cents for those, great deal. These were not on clearance, but I absolutely love these, and I will swear by these. They are the permanent tape runner, double-sided tape, one quarter um, inch. Um, bonds instantly photo safe. I got three of them. They're a dollar each and I love these and I it is hard to find them So I picked up three and they're only a dollar each and then more gum I picked them up the Wrigley's extra 110 so I paid 55 cents just for more packs of gum for my son. So I do usually pick him up um, The sugar free. I definitely try to do that I'm just trying to see. Oh, these are still from yesterday, I think. They are. Is there a receipt in here? Because I know this is from a different store. Hold on. You all, if I skip out of this chair. Okay, I don't know. But I'm going to try to take my guesses. I'm pretty sure I can remember how much they were. So this right here, I paid... Um, so this is normally a dollar. I think I paid five cents. Yeah, it's 10 cents, five. So this is an eight pack of the True Living Reusable Wipes. So I paid five cents for these. So of course I got them. So even though purple is not a penny, it is still 90% off. So again, now I went yesterday. And so this last weekend, it was 90% off plus an additional 50% off. So I paid five cents for this but it is still 90% right now. So you would still only pay a dollar, I'm sorry, you would still only pay 10 cents for all of these. So if you went to your store right now and found these right here, they'd only be 10 cents. So yeah, I got those. Um, uh, I'm trying to, okay, so I picked these up and they're normally 450. I love these things in my house. And these ones are Midnight Breeze 135. Um, and so I paid half of that. I don't know where that receipt is. So I picked up them in the Midnight Breeze. They're just three of the scented oil refills and then three in the Hint of Spring. So 135. So like I said, it's like 75 cents or something. I don't even know. But yeah. Um, this is not game. This one smells like game dryer sheets. So again, normally $4 and I paid less than a dollar for three. So. When I went to this store, so this is a store I don't go to very much, and let me tell you, people will walk in there and they literally just shop. They will shop and they just walk out the front door like it's nothing. They don't pay, they don't do nothing. Nobody says anything, and I'm just like, well, no wonder they do it. If you don't have consequences for what you do. And like, yeah, well, we can't really stop them. I'm like, but you can't say anything? Because I watched this guy literally just walk through the store, just getting whatever he wanted, and then just walk right out the front door. He just left. And I was like, and he's like, yeah, we're not allowed to say anything. I'm like, well, then why are the rest of us paying? You know, like if, and then I drive down the road and I see him there, right there at the bus stop. And I'm like, I just don't understand it. Like if you, I mean, I get, you can't chase them down. You can't do whatever. But if they're just walking out and you're not even going to say anything and 
acknowledge that he just walked out with half your stuff, then, I mean, we might as well try it. I would never be able to. But I'm just saying, like, if there's absolutely no consequences, people are like, oh, well, I mean, they get packed. That's what they have insurance for. And I'm like, okay, but does that make it right? No, it doesn't. So, anyways, it that super pisses me off. I get super upset about that. Anyways, this is lemon scrub free. I found this in the clearance section and I paid 50 cents for this and it just hangs on your toilet. It's got five balls, <laughs> like five little dingleberries, right? So anyways, I got that for 50 cents because um, it was in the clearance section. So it was an additional 50% off. I believe that this was 50 cents. I can't 100% tell you. It's scrub. No, no. I got this from the Dollar Tree. Ooh. I forgot to show this in my last haul. This was from the Dollar Tree, a dollar twenty-five. Yep, Greenbrier, right there. Scrub Buddy soap dispensing brush. Um, I'll do anything to try to have my family do the dishes while I'm gone. So I got that. Yeah. Oopsie, that was the Dollar Tree. So I found these two fifty. So I paid one twenty-five, and they are LA colors. Is there more than one in here? I don't think so. What is it? Yeah, just the one, right? Yeah. Um, stick out nail wraps salon shine three nail strips and one nail file um and they're just like it's called strawberry daiquiri y'all i love me a strawberry daiquiri but for 125 i thought they were cute dollar tree does have them but i mean i got them so i got those i found these you guys these were 35 cents each 35 they had a lot of them but i only got one of each because what the heck am i gonna do with all of them so i picked this up it's day to night by dollar general la colors um, so it was 35 cents for that one. Oh no. Oh, my husband's out working in the side yard again. Um, so anyways, those are gorgeous colors. So I paid 35 cents for that. And then this one is called day to night by LA colors. Also, it's got the darker colors. If you can see how super pretty are theirs. Oh my gosh. So 30, so a dollar for less than both of those. Oh, my husband is out there because I see some little puppies over here. No, sir. You don't need to right now. Um, so these are nail coffin tips. They are, um, longer than, but I will cut them down, but it's, um, I believe I paid $1 total for these, um, coffin nail tips and they are just, um, so they have the nails, but also has the, um, polish for your pedicure. And for a dollar, I was like, yes. So I got those and they are by, um, LA colors, color craze, pop on nail tips. So I got those. You guys, if you can tell me on the um, Sally, like hand, whatever, kiss, whatever, the press on nails, how do I get that like already glue stuff off of them? That is crap and I can never get it off. And then when I try to put it on my nail, they fall off all day long, super frustrating. I find so many that are so cute and I wanna get, but I cannot figure out how to get that stuff off the back first. So please tell me how to get like that press on glue stuff off. Um, there's a bottom to this somewhere here we go no sir so this was um five cents so i picked it up because i thought it was cute um it is like i guess a little bit like cracked right there kind of but um i just thought it was cute and it's normally five dollars but it's a purple dot so i paid five cents and it just says be happy and it's just you know like this bamboo wooden thing so i was like mm, this would be so cute like on my dresser or something i mean yeah so else. I might not even be able to add Hobby Lobby in here. I think I'm only going to be able to do this and then Hobby Lobby will have to be its own. I paid, did I get these just, oh yeah, I didn't get any today. So I paid 20 cents for these. So again, right now, if you went to the store and you found these, they would be 40 cents right now. But because I found them over the weekend, they were an additional 50% off. So I paid 20 cents. But even if you paid 40 cents, these are true living meal prep round food, food containers freezer safe microwave safe top rack dishwasher safe a five pack and my um youngest son right now is trying to meal prep and stuff so i mean they were just there so that's awesome so there's five of those and then i know that there was more somewhere else but i don't know i don't know where they're at right this second which means i have a bag somewhere. so we'll just keep going um so you guys they had so many of like their doormats and everything for a dollar. Again, they should have been a penny because they're purple dot, but um, they're not. So anyways, picked this up. It's got like the things on the side. I, I unplugged them all because they're too loud for my video. I did. 
There's like four things plugged in too. Um, so this is a jute rug, hand woven rug, 20 by 30 inches, normally $10, but I'll plug them back in when I'm done. That's what he gets for saying, um, trying to explain to me that one's in a drain and one's in a bucket. If you guys watch my Dollar Tree haul right before this, you'll know the restoration guy made me feel like a complete idiot. Um, but anyways, $10, so I paid, um, a dollar for this, which is an amazing deal regardless. So I got that for a dollar. It's a jute rug. Okay, I got two of them. So here is two of those I picked up for a dollar. Um, oh gosh, I guess I picked up three. There's another one. Oh, hmm. I guess I picked up three for a dollar. I have to find a place for those. This is a doormat. So I actually got this yesterday. So again, if you found this today, which there's a million of these, it would be a dollar twenty, right? But because um, I found it yesterday, I paid sixty cents for this, and it is a very thick, durable front doormat that says hello. So for sixty cents, I got it. Again, there was so many of these guys; it was crazy. So you would so like today sorry this thing is hitting all over the place you would pay a dollar because it's 90 percent off but again i got this over the weekend so it was additional 50 percent off so i paid 50 cents for this huge mat so i have that um and it just says the crab attitude at leave the crab attitude at the door it's thick yeah so there's that one I'm sorry if I'm confusing you. I'm trying to remember because again, yesterday was an additional 50% off and today was not. So I got this today and it says it's normally $6. So I did pay 60 cents for this today, but I think it's gorgeous. It's like pottery. You can put your plant in there. So for 60 cents, I got that. Okay. Okay. And then... I picked this up today for 40 cents and it says breathe and it just has the little um, fake cacti in it because again, I can't keep anything alive. These are my all time favorite candy. So I love when Halloween comes out. I do like the orange ones better because they have a little bit of peanut butter in them versus the black ones, but they're a dollar. So I picked those up for me. So if you see any of these, these are a penny. I know guys, like it's a mess. The prices right now that they are doing is a mess. It's horrible, but so these are a penny. So if you see any of these slush puppies, anything like that, they are a penny. You guys, what I totally suggest is that you make sure that when you get on your Dollar General app, that you change it to whatever store you are at. I went to two different stores today and I made sure to change it to two different stores and make sure it's at the store that I was currently at. And so um, I scanned it there and then I would see how much it was. So this is a penny right now and then this right here I paid 80 cents for which I think is an amazing deal it's um, just like this little woven basket that is beautiful it's normally it's normally eight dollars but I paid 80 cents I think that's a super amazing deal okay I had hauled some of these before but yesterday they were only 50 cents because Again, yesterday was an additional 50% off, so normally $10. If you find these right now, they are only a dollar, which is still an amazing deal. But I got them two more yesterday for 50 cents, and I plan on just like sanding that off and making little Christmas trays. So I got those for 50 cents. Well, I'm still not done. I know, I know. And then, how much did I pay for these yesterday? So I paid 50 cents for each of these yesterday. If I would have found more, I would have bought them. So if you look right there, it says $10. If you find these again today or anytime this week, these are only a dollar if you find them at your store. But I got them again yesterday, so I paid 50 cents. But if you find these at your store right now, they are a dollar. Super good deal regardless, right? Um, oh, it's dark out here. I, oh, I didn't bring my cereal, but the Kellogg's cereal. So I got two things of Raisin Bran, one thing of um, Frosted Mini Wheats, and one thing of Corn Pops, and it was four for eight dollars. You guys, that is two dollars a box of cereal. It is an amazing deal. You don't have to have the coupon or anything. So, like, a, if you're going to the Dollar General, two dollars for a box of you have to get four of them, but four boxes of name brand cereal for eight dollars total, amazing deal. So get those. Um. Oh gosh, here's more of these things. Oh, I need to send her home with these. 
These are only 10 cents, but there are more of them. So normally a dollar. I picked them up today. That was 10 cents. That was 10 cents. I'll probably just like, um, they were all just 10 cents. I'll probably just recolor them for Christmas or something. Okay. I think this is all for this haul. Ice cream. I was super excited. I've been looking everywhere for Christmas napkins. So I was super excited to find these. These are um, 16 counts. And they are Christmas napkins so I can decoupage on stuff. So look at how gorgeous that is. And then on the back, look at the little reindeer. So these were a dollar and these were two dollars. But look at the red truck on it. And then like the black gingham. So beautiful. I was super excited to find them. Ooh, we are 20 minutes. All right, guys. Yeah, I am going to have to stop this one, do a Hobby Lobby, and then I'm done. And I so hot out here, I might pass out. So I hope that you guys have an amazing day. Thank you so much for continuing to support me. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.